Understanding the goddess of wisdom, knowledge, and music, that is Saraswati. Saraswati, the mother, the divine mother. that represents the satoguni aspect of the divine mother she holds a veena a musical instrument in her hand this is two meanings one is music and the other is vibration In Indian classical music there are seven swaras namely sa ri ga ma pa dha and ni they are sung like sa re ga ma pa dha ni sa ni dha pa ma ga re sa this is saraswati ji's entire scale you know in indian classical music or the hindustani shastriya sangeet there are seven swaras namely sa re ga ma pa dha ni in an awakened state you experience om or a particular vibration or spandan at seven different levels in your pranic system this is the above saraswati is the goddess of music so she teaches in this way the teaching begins here 
as her disciple you experience musical kriya the kriya is so unbound and vast that you know that if i continue the practice there is no limit the music takes you into a state of ecstasy so that is fine but this kriya has a source and you can't get away by saying it's om because om has a source too if you ascend om you will experience ajapa and beyond that the soundless now this soundless too is a world a small and subtle world there is a center which has got no location but it's a pinpoint or a bindu you transcend this and you are into nothing i believe from my experience that nothing is the source or the origin while nothing for me is the shiva pinpoint or bindu is para shakti but state of being is more important than names however shiva is a mantra shivaya nama is one great mantra while om nama shivaya is another great mantra om duyam which finally becomes om shambhu in a very intense way is another mantra but very intense om itself is a fantastic mantra a seed mantra the seven swaras are born out of this seed mantra saraswati an aspect of parashakti is the conductor as well as teacher of this knowledge devi saraswati helps you understand that om is not just present and happening or happens at one level like many books teach but at almost all levels under the crown in our body om is a universal presence if we were to assume our body as a universe this is the case for all humans to be honest om always for me has been one of the greatest delicacies but there is more to saraswati ma saraswati she produces a very powerful and intense mantra kriya called aing which is a bijaksha or a seed mantra in my experience ma saraswati makes aing the bijakshar happen inside you in my case it happened from anahata the heart region to vishuddhi the throat region and has stayed with me mother or ma saraswati is the giver of this mantra and kriya in a very intense manner like every mother she is a very devoted teacher and sees to it that the job is done if shakti is awakened and complete belief and faith is there you just need to prepare yourself to be ready to receive because mother mother divine is always ready you don't have to please her just get ready enter your inner sanctum with eyes closed and ask keep asking and have patience and if possible stillness how do you ask or pray through an amalgamation of mantra faith rituals meditation and prayer prayer part is actually the toughest part which is taught by a true help this help will be a siddha buddha and the enlightened one they help you connect so always look out for the signs of a siddha 
there are more than 100 signs which I will elaborate soon. So Aing is Saraswati Devi's Beej Mantra. But apart from Veena, she is dressed in white which represents peace and justice. Ma Saraswati is also the giver of Satoguna which means good attributes such as positivity, peace, justice, truth, honesty and compassion. In the cosmos it means the dark ages are way gone and the light years have arrived. In the creation this too shall pass. Ma Saraswati is a great aspect of Shakti in the humans who can offer you the power, the chariot of lightning without any thunder in the inner space with which you can have cosmic experiences. Know yourself and a lot more. She is a great giver all the way. I am fortunate to be her disciple and bow down to her. I hope I will be able to share about her much better and involve people in transforming practices at a larger scale. Saraswati Devi without doubt is one of the most divine active and important aspects of Parashakti. I would like to repeat that Ma Saraswati, Ma Lakshmi and Ma Kali are immense. Saraswati Mata